Welcome back to my channel. It is your girl Barbie K tuning in for another mother freaking banger. And today is going to be the start of Vlogmas. I'm wrapping up my semester for school this week, so I have ample time to lock in with YouTube and get these videos out for you guys. So that's what I plan on doing. So as you can see by the title of the video, today we're gonna be decorating, baking cookies, just getting into the holiday spirit because I'm not really feeling the, the Christmas vibe just yet. So I'm at Michael's right now. I'm about to show y'all. Period. My mom was saying that they have a 50% off Christmas tree sale. So I want to see if I can find a pink Christmas tree to go upstairs in my loft. And if I can't find a pink tree, it's really not a big deal to me. Because I'm not even going to be in my house on Christmas Day this year. I'm going to be out the country. So decorating is just for fun purposes. I'm about to go into Michael's, see what decorations we can find. If I don't find a lot. It might be okay because there is a Target in this plaza as well. We'll just see what we get. Let's get right into it. store i already have ornaments and all that at home the theme for my house is gold so everything has to be like gold or silver this is cute 30 dollars though 30 dollars for a little fake tree is not it any stockings three of these and i'm gonna put our initials on here i don't see a pink christmas tree they honestly probably only have it online this is cute i don't want to hang nothing on these are like decorations you have to hang up and I don't want to hang up anything because it's really not that deep. This little white Christmas tree is only $15. We'll get one. Put this upstairs. A K for me and a G for my mom. So I got all my family's initials. Target with it and we're going to the Christmas department because if I go anywhere else I'm gonna end up spending too much money I'm here to buy Christmas decorations and Christmas decorations only period body can't make this up home either you got it or you don't okay I know I'm in here for Christmas but there's no way I'm leaving without picking up this book but if you know you know tree for 35 dollars it's kind of cute y'all i'm gonna get this tree and put it upstairs all right this is the last store i'm going to Alright y'all, so I just brought in all my Christmas decorations. I'm to sort through everything. First thing we got is this white Christmas tree from Target. It's probably gonna go on my dresser. Everything in this bag is also from Target. So I got this pink little like plush Christmas tree. And I got this gold garland. You'll see why I bought gold. And I also got silver garland. So from Target, I bought a pack of fuzzy socks, an extension cord. I got this cute pink ornament. I got pink ribbon for the tree. I got this little 2022 snowflake. This little pony. This cute like retro pink TV. And I got this pink ribbon. I also got this pink glitter chateau sugar cookie kit. But it's like a gingerbread house. Pink 
gingerbread house. I just felt like this was so cute and Christmas themed. Then I got me a bottle of Stella. I got blueberry. Blueberry is my favorite. So for Michael's, three stockings for me, my mom, and my brother. These like little diamond initial decals to put on the stockings. Then I got this garland. I'm gonna put this in my living room. It's like pink and gold. This reindeer, it's like white reindeer. It's cute. Then we got this bag. I got this like little diamond Christmas tree. This pink little Christmas tree situation. I got two light up present boxes. This one and this one. Light up present boxes. Pretty cute. Just press this button. That's cute. I really didn't do too much. My goal was not to do too much. I'm gonna show y'all what like my living rooms look like. I want y'all to see the vision. I have our Christmas tree up already. My living room looks like these are the ornaments we have. And this is my tree. This is what my upstairs, like my living room looks like. I'm thinking of putting the pink garland like here somewhere. Take all my books away and decorate real nice and cute. So I'm about to do the tree. It's my aunt and my mom helping me out. This is what the ornaments look like. You guys also gotta get these. They're like the hooks for the ornaments. You got these things to tuck into the tree. Yeah, but how's that gonna look? They're done and everything is dressed. Tucking up Macy's and they look really nice on the tree. Dressed, you just tuck them in. Decorating the tree first. You guys wanna be introduced to my YouTube channel? We could do a segment where a 19 year old like me or like a teenager in general asks an adult questions that some girls are too afraid to ask their mom. So my first question is, what do you think is the appropriate age to allow your daughters to start dating? In reality, I'll say 25. No, in reality. <laughs> no, I think um, it depends. Okay, okay. 17. Yeah, 17 is reasonable. 17. Like junior year of high school? Yeah. That's reasonable. Mom, you didn't answer the question. Oh, I know. Finish my wine. I didn't finish my wine. Are you like that? No. If you could do one thing different in your right. whole life, what would it be? See, Don, this question, she said that when she came to when she came to America, she would have became a doctor instead of just a nurse. Mm -hmm. She said it's just because she didn't know she could be a doctor. I would finish up my PhD a long time ago. Mm. What about you, yeah. mommy? What would you do different? Really? Yep. Tell me, Kara. Yeah. What do you think is a good age for you to have sex? Um, like me or like just teenage girls in general? Teenage girls in general. Like knowing what I know now, I just feel like it's better for just every girl to wait. Because there's no right age. Obviously there's too young. Every girl should just wait. If you could give girls my age, one piece of dating advice, what would you give them? Somebody shows you who they are, believe them. Mm, that's good. Believe actions, not words. My advice would be never, ever, ever put a man or anything before your your, your interest first because a man's never gonna put your, your interest before his. It's never gonna happen. And if you think that, that's just delusion. So I'm not saying don't compromise, because compromise is important. There's this conversation on Instagram right now because like nowadays, boys will like fly out a girl, like pay for her flight to come see them in a different city or whatever. Mm -mm. But a lot of men must think fly you out, they're expecting sex. They expected, that, so, that's the reason they fly you out. That's my advice is just, if you don't want to have sex, just don't take the flight. Exactly. Because I'm not saying like that that's right for a man to expect that, because it's not, but it's a man at the end of the day. And that's just how they are. Yep. Yeah. So I think you should just save yourself the headache, and if you know you don't want to have sex with him, don't go. Don't go All right guys, so the tree is basically done. All right. Can you bring these back? So look at all this hard work we've been doing, guys. Black Santa, cause this is a black household and it's Black Lives Matter. So in my loft, I put up the white tree. This one's from Target. This reindeer from Hobby Lobby. This is from Hobby Lobby too, I believe. I'm about to do the ornaments for the tree. Also have some pink ribbon. I'm so excited for Vlogmas, like. I feel like this is the month where I can finally get consistent with YouTube without running out of ideas or motivation. It's literally vlogmas. Like, how could you run out of motivation? I want to talk to y'all about like 2023 and what that's gonna look like for me. I'm gonna wait until a 
little later to talk about that. I have a lot to talk to y'all about, especially on this channel, because I don't even really have any sit down style videos. So Snowflake is so cute. Okay, y'all, so I think I'm done with up here. I believe so. I don't have any more decorations to put up, so this is what it's giving. Got the reindeer in the middle. My little Christmas tree. It's not that cute because the tree is like, you see like all the empty space, like it's not thick enough, but I did what I could. We got the garland. I think it's pretty cute. And then in my room, the silver tree is just gonna stay right here. It's nothing too crazy. I don't got nowhere else to put it, so. The garland looks like. Real cute. The front table, the black Santa Claus. This is the tree. And then I didn't put up the stockings I bought because it doesn't match. Hey y'all, so it's currently, it's Monday. I think the last time I spoke to y'all was either Friday or Saturday. Right now I'm at Beauty Masters. I'm just here to pick up a few products because I'm doing my friend Bree's hair later. We're about to get together later tonight after I get off work. So I want to try the L'Oreal. Well, I've tried it before, but I didn't buy like a big thing of it. My knots have been pulling so brassy lately. I'm over that. I just need to get a few products and I also want to get more perfume oil. Last time I came here, it has some really good perfume oil that I'm wearing right now. And it smells so good, so. I don't have too much time because I do work in like 30 minutes, so I'm gonna try and be quick. Take y'all along with me, let's get it, let's go. All right, so I need the quick blue of this one. I don't want this big one though. I think this is really big, but I guess I might as well get the big one since I'm about to start up my business and all that. All right, we just gonna get the big one. I'm gonna get 40 volume developer. It's quicker. I feel like I have advanced from 30 to 40 volume developer. What's this? Ooh, should I get a new hairspray? I love the Tresemme conditioners. And I do wigs and stuff like that. I think I'm gonna get the Silky Smooth one. Conditioner. Right, I'm gonna do this one. I'm only getting these clips because they're pink. And this is just too cute. All the perfume oils, y'all. This is everything we got. Maybe even on the coast, disguised in regalia, and making the most. I did some damage, y'all. A little more than I planned. I'm not gonna lie, but it's okay. It's okay. This is an investment to a greater good. All right, y'all. So I just got back home. It's currently 2 a.m. I was supposed to get home an hour ago, but <laughs> that's neither here nor there. I'm gonna show y'all what I got from the beauty supply store before I go through this bag. So first I got this Tresemme Silky Smooth Conditioner. I really like Tresemme products on wigs, so. Then I got some L'Oreal Quick Blue Bleach for bleaching the knots. I used to use BW2, but this one's better because the knots don't pull as brassy because there's a blue undertone. That's just my knowledge from cosmetology school. Like, if you don't know a little something about hair. And they gave me this free cup of my purchase, so that's cute, it's pink. And I got Shimmer Light Shampoo. This is also for taking out the brassiness when it comes to bleaching your knots. Then I got a big thing of 40 Volume Developer. I got these really big because I'm about to start up doing hair, so it's better just buy a big one than I'll keep buying little ones. Dying Bowl, because I threw my last one away. Then I got some hair clips. They're also pink. More hair clips. It's got three Ruby Kisses cream foundation colors. I just bought like the three most common colors of black girls that I be seeing. A etched brush, a rat tail comb. I bought three perfume oils. So that's all I got from the beauty supply store. It's actually like the next day from when I last spoke to y'all. I did Bree's hair yesterday. But as you can see, I have my hair in pink curls right now and we're about to take some pictures. I'm gonna try and get more pictures in this jumpsuit that I'm wearing. We're gonna try this again. And then if those are not coming out cute, then I'm just gonna change into my other outfit. Which is Leah. Y'all, this hat is too cute. I shouldn't even be on the internet with this hat on, but it don't matter because the hat is cute and the brim is pink. And pink is my color, so. But yeah, I'm just waiting on Brie. She's taking pictures right now, her cute ass. Not gonna drink wine, we drank wine last night and that didn't go too well. So, we're just gonna keep it cute tonight. 
This camera quality is too good. Alright y'all, so I'm not even gonna lie. I'm not even about to get on this camera and cap right now. Last time I picked up my camera was about five days ago when I was with Bree. But I have a good reason, okay? I have a really, really good reason. My finals week whooped my ass. I had to put in work that last week, y'all. If I had picked up this camera and focused on YouTube and vlogging, then my grades wouldn't have looked the way they look. I was putting in work last week, like for real, for real. School comes before YouTube. So, having said that, I'm back and I'm better. I was about to start vlogging tomorrow, but I'm like, you know what? Since I've been gone for so long, let me pick up my camera right now and pick up where we left off. Because I'm not even gonna lie, we a little behind. But we're gonna catch up real quick. Like, it ain't nothing. It ain't nah. It's currently 11.32 p.m. I'm about to get in the shower. I have to start editing my weekly vlog that I filmed about, like, two, three weeks ago i'm not even gonna lie i'm so mad at myself for not getting it out sooner but it's okay because i'm gonna get it out this week as soon as i'm done getting that video out i'm gonna start editing this video that you guys are watching right now so let me just take my shower and i'll see y'all in a minute quick side note can we talk about how my lashes still look really good after two weeks like, my lash text retention don't play. All right, y'all, so I just got out the shower. I'm all fresh and clean and all that. If my lighting looks weird, I don't know why I'd be doing that whenever I put this light on. Maybe looking a little off, like, okay. I don't know. Maybe looking a little off to me. But I'm about to start editing. It's really late. Like, I'm not even gonna lie. I'm gonna be pulling an all-nighter. I probably would've been at, like, 8 o'clock in the morning because I just wanna edit, 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 edit all night. I have my Bev. And I got me a snack. I love applesauce. But it has to be the cinnamon one. I'm not gonna be able to film me editing because I need to take my SD card on my camera to put it in the SD card reader to plug it into my laptop to get the footage to edit. So, 